All right, today we are reacting to the new animated short for Honkai Star Rail, The Embers of Glamoth. And I'm really excited about this, not just because of how much I like Firefly and Sam, but also because these animated shorts, they always seem to hit. They always seem to be amazing. And considering how cool Sam's design is, they absolutely probably did cook in this. And it's a full six minute animated short. So this is definitely going to be a big one. I'm going to get subtitles on as well so we can know what's going on. But let's get right into the reaction here. And if y'all want to see more Honkai Star Rail content from me, definitely be sure to hit that subscribe button. The support is always greatly appreciated. So let's get right into this. I'm not going to stall for, the, for a video this long. All right, probably in some kind of battle, it looks like. Okay, see, I knew this was going to look good. Look at look, look at Sam. <laughs> look at Sam there. Oh, I'm fighting the swarm, it looks like. Yeah, because I'm pretty sure in the lore, the, um, the Glamoth was... Yeah, you know, they had to fight the swarm. So... Well, okay. Hey, Firefly. Yo, look at all the Sams. See, I, I, I would love so much if they revealed to us at some point in the story that more than just Firefly, you know, survived from this. And we can actually, like, meet them in-game. Because having multiple Sams in a cutscene would be crazy. Like, I mean, just seeing it here right now in this animated short is crazy. Ooh, ooh, it's a, it's a big swarm. Yeah, they're gonna cook with this. Oh, they, they they're getting cooked. Oh, my fault. That's not good. Okay, bro. Bro's going on a full assault. All right. Oh, nah. Okay, Firefly was the one that was given the, uh, the little con hologram control panel thing. Alright, I, I guess they're just gonna blow it up now? Yep. Hey, hey, hey I'll, I'll, I'll be real, everyone. Sometimes the sometimes we gotta do a bug. Sometimes you just gotta, <laughs> you, you, you just gotta blow it up, you know? I get it, I get it. Yeah, but now Glamoth is cooked. I'm sure, at least. They got to be cooked after that. I mean, we know Firefly lived, but we'll, we'll see if anyone else is still there. Oh, oh and, all, and all their armor is gone, too. That lo looks like everyone, except for you, which is crazy. I wonder how, how she specifically survived, though. Oh, someone else. Okay, hold up. There's someone else. Oh, no, never mind. She... she is she cooked? She 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 she's either emotional or she's cooked. 
which I mean, I don't blame them for being emotional after seeing what their uh, Scorch Earth attack did. I know it says in my in my Myriad Celestia reaction, but th those uh those like combat suits, they 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 gotta make that a Firefly skin. They 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 gotta make that a Firefly skin. That would absolutely sell. But Glamoth no longer exists. Yeah, Glamoth is cooked. As soon as I saw that explosion, I was like, yeah, Glamoth Glamoth is so cooked. Transforming again, all right. I said, I said, I said, that's where the green comes from. But you know, I, I ever since we saw uh, like the live stream and everything, I've been wondering why there's the like green flame as opposed to, and even a bit in her character art too. I was like, why do we see the green flame as opposed to like the the red flames throughout? But it now it makes some more sense here. Oh, oh, okay. All right, Firefly. Oh, yeah, Glamoth is super cooked. Yeah, Glamoth is just, it's not even a wasteland anymore, it's just gone. Oh, did she get trapped in space? Kafka! So I get, yeah, that's probably how Celeron Hunters found her then, cause yeah, cause it, that seems like it's right after she destroy, um, you know, left Glomoth and Glomoth was destroyed. But that way, yeah, that I knew that image where it was gonna go crazy, especially with all the action scenes too. Like I know, I know I didn't react to it uh, when it came out, but I remember the Acheron animated short had a lot, also a lot of you know really good like kind of action shots with the whole like Acheron thing, but. Yeah, this one with the whole Glamoth fight against the Swarm. This, I, I, I knew they were going to cook here. Like, I had a feeling that th th this was going to cook just because of how cool Sam is. Plus, also just the way of them having to fight all like the bugs. Yeah, they, they, they really cooked with this animated short. I, I, I can't even lie. And then the part of the end, you know, the symbolic, like... Oh, hold on. Let me, let me see that again. Yeah, because it actually looked really good. I didn't actually peep how good this looks. That's actually really good. Man, they always seem to cook with these animated shorts. Yeah, that Firefly, you know, flying off from Glamoth and destroying it. And then, yeah, then she gets found by Kafka. And that's probably how she joins the Celeron Hunters from there. Man, Hoyoverse can never miss with these animated shorts. Every single one has been amazing. Dancing among the stars. Oh, plus ending it with Kafka. We, we do love to see that. But yeah, let me know in the comments down below what you all thought of this animated short. I thought that this was absolutely peak. And I can't wait for Firefly to come out next week. But if you guys enjoyed and haven't already, as I said, definitely be sure to hit that subscribe button. The support's greatly appreciated. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you all next time.